I love talking to women. I love working with women. Uh, the revelation of the last 10 years of my life has been that women are amazing and awesome and fabulous and women in teams are just astounding. Dream, big dreams. If someone had said to me 10 years ago, you're going to climb the seven summits and you're going to climb Everest, I would have gone, <laughs> what a ridiculous notion. As if I'm going to do that. Di's just been a fantastic speaker because she has spoken from her own experiences. She's shown us that those metaphorical mountains really are just another challenge that you can get up. Obstacles are opportunities. So every time someone puts up an obstacle in your way, either work out a way around it or step over the top of it. And mostly when an obstacle that's absolutely insurmountable gets put in your way, like for me, like an absolute cliff, and you have to completely reroute yourself, other doors open. Has anyone had that experience? Because we've all got mountains to climb, and when we come and we hear someone speak from the heart as Di has, um, we know that there really isn't anything that we can't do. Have a big dream. It's so exciting when you have a big dream. It could be anything. We took seven women to climb Mount Aconcagua after eight years of learning what crampons are and learning what gear you need and doing lots of shopping. And when you're climbing a high mountain, you really want to give up because you feel like crap and you go, what am I doing this for? This is totally insane. And I even wanted to give up and you know, I had every reason to be there on my, you know, on my second attempt. And it was only one of the other girls at a point that said to me, come on, <laughs> come on, let's do it. And she's inspired me so much that I have just committed to doing Kilimanjaro with her next year. So um, it's just going to be an amazing trip. I just had to join in somehow. So I am. I encourage you, if you hate your job or if, you, or if you're ambivalent, change. Life's too short to hate your job. You want feedback. If you've got a team of people around you or, or, or people close to you or your good friends, encourage them to give you honest feedback. Hit me with the yucky stuff as well. You will learn the most. Feedback is fertiliser for the soul. I would recommend this session with Di because I thought she was very infectious. Her energy is very infectious and she just gets down to the basics and, and gets you thinking about all the basics in your life. And once you do that, I, I think you can make some really good goals and, and have great plans for your future. And I'm going to encourage you to take that lesson back to your business, to your life, to your goals, whether they're business goals or personal goals, whether you're looking to end a relationship or begin a new relationship, or whether you're look, looking to earn more money or get more clients or have a more balanced lifestyle or lose weight, any of those goals that we all have will be achieved if you never, never, never give up.